lived in this city all my life. I'm Max, and I'm the luckiest dog in New York. Because of her. That's Katie. Katie and I, well, we have the perfect relationship. We met a few years ago, and boy, let me tell you, we got along right away. You know, it was, it was one of those relationships where, where you just know. And, and get this, she was looking for a roommate, and so was I. So I just moved in that same day. It was perfect. We've been together ever since. Katie would do anything for me, and I'm her loyal protector. Our love is, our love is, how do I put this? I, I, our love is stronger than words or shoes. It's me and Katie. Katie and me. It's against the world. I wouldn't go so far as to call us soulmates, even though any sane person who saw us would. Just one little problem. Pretty much every day. Come on, Max. She leaves. See you tonight. Sometimes I try stuff to get her to stay. Okay. Sit. Spin. Speak. <laughs> okay. That's a good boy. But it never works. Where is she going? What could she possibly be doing? Oh, I miss her so much. Oh my, oh, she's back! Forgot my phone. What took so long? Why did you... Oh, come on! Oh, I miss her so much. Bye, Gidget. Be a good doggy. Hey, Max. Hey, Gidget. Any plans today? Uh, yes. Big, big stuff today, Gidget. I got big plans. I'm going to sit here, and I'm going to wait for Katie to come back. Oh, that sounds exciting. Well, I won't interrupt. I've got a very busy day, too. <sighs> here you go. See you later, Chloe. Peppy. Come on, Mel. Hi, sweet pea. See you, Gino. Bye, so long, pal. I'll miss you, Shelly. Later, Runty. Bye, everyone. Bye. Be a good boy, Leonard. Max. Hey, Chloe, do you ever wonder where they go during the day? Do you know what? I just, I don't really care. Maybe that's what it's like for you, but Katie and I have a different relationship. You know, you're, you're a cat, so maybe that's why, because nobody could ever love a cat the way they love a dog. I'm just saying. Maybe that's why. Whatever you need to tell yourself. Good morning, Max. Hey, guys. Stop, sweet pea. Hey, Mel. Where you been, man? Oh, get this. Last Sunday, my owner feeds me a small white pill, right? I start to feel a little groggy. The next thing I know, I wake up, I'm in the sky. Wait a minute, the, the sky? Yeah, there's suitcases everywhere. I'm locked up in a crate. <laughs> Come on. There's suitcases in the sky? So I pass out from fear, and when I wake up, I'm in Florida. Um, this did not happen. I will never eat a pill like that again, unless it's covered in peanut butter. Because, I mean, come on, right? It's peanut butter. Hey, guys. Oh, hey, Norman. You still looking for your apartment? Yeah, going on three weeks now. It's just the second or the third floor. Well, I don't know any numbers, but uh, you don't live here. Ah, tell it. Well, see you guys later. You know what? You can do it. Can't do it. See, there, there you are. Did, did, did you find it? <laughs> you know I did. Ball! Ball, ball, ball! <laughs> Katie's going to be so excited. Th this is exactly like what she lost. I mean, look at it. It's round. It fits in my mouth. Ball! Yeah! <laughs> There is no other ball in the city like this one ball. Guaranteed, this is the ball. Katie! Katie! Hello, Max. <laughs> hey, Maximilian. How was your day, buddy? That's a good boy. Oh, yes. I'm so psyched to see you, too, buddy. Okay, boy. Calm down. It's okay. Let's all be calm. Now, I have some big news. I know this will take some getting used to, but... 
But I think it's gonna be a great thing in the long run. Oh. Max, this is Duke. <gasps> He's going to be your brother. No, Max. Okay, it's gonna be all right, Duke. It's okay. Oh, see, he likes you. <laughs> yeah, that's it, Duke. Take a look around. No, buddy. This is a lot to take in, but he didn't have a home. So you and I are gonna have to take care of him. Okay? Oh my gosh! Duke found our lost ball! What a great team we're gonna be! Hey, Maxie. Love you, Duke. Tight boys. Little guy, this place is so great. Uh huh. By the way, that is that is one gorgeous bed. Yeah, it's okay. Maybe we could share. You know, one night you get the bed, the next night I do. That kind of thing. You know, this bed is mine. You you get an old blanket. That, that that suits you. You're an old blanket kind of a dog. <laughs> oh, wow. You are stubborn. Hey, I, I get it. I'm stubborn, too. But we got to learn to get along. Wait, what do you... How about we can both fit in this bed if we really no, try? No, no. Let's get on in there. No, wait. Oh, ah! Perfect. This is comfy. Ah, right? No, it is not. Ah! Ah! I'm comfy. Lucas is ruining our lives. He's ruining... It's an emergency that you get rid of this dog. He stole my... <laughs> he's scary and he's frightening and he's the death of all good things. Aw, you did a cutie pie. We'll play tomorrow, buddy, okay? Okay, sleep well. You trying to get rid of me? Before I answer that, I, I'd like to know how much you heard. So that's how it's gonna be, huh? Oh, man, are you making me angry. And when I get angry... I do this. <sighs> I don't want to do that. I need this place. And if it's going to come down to you or me, it's going to be me. Chloe! Chloe, Chloe, I got a bad situation. Katie brought home a new dog from the pound. She said he's my brother. I don't want a brother, and I don't I don't even have a bed now. I'm sleeping on the floor like a dog. Why would Katie do this to me? Because she's a dog person, Max. And dog people do weird, inexplicable things, like they get dogs instead of cats. Okay, please don't start now, Chloe. That is not helping. Max, come on. I'm your friend. Okay, and as your friend, I gotta be honest with you, I don't care about you or your problems. But, if you don't do something about this guy, and soon, your perfect little life with your dumb uh, human is 